opening day for baseball is tomorrow and Missourians are one step closer to legal sports betting on the Cardinals and other teams. It is a topic that lawmakers have been looking at this session. All new at six, our Missouri Chief Capitol Bureau reporter Emily Manley is live with where the idea stands in the show me state. Emily. Well, that's right. If you currently try to place a bet on your phone in Missouri using a service like FanDuel, you cannot because it's illegal. But it's closer to a reality than it's ever been. After today, when the state's professional sports teams came to the Capitol and testified in front of the Senate. One of the other things that this, this bill helps us to do is remain competitive. Sports betting is allowed in more than 30 states, but not Missouri. They might cross the border and place a bet and then go back to collect or whatever. Um, or they'll hear about their friends doing it in Illinois and then just sign up for an app that ends up being like an illegal black market app. Professional sports teams from around the state want lawmakers to let fans legally place wagers. Our organization believes the legalization of sports betting in Missouri will further energize and engage our fan base. For us to be able to continue to compete at that level, it is important for us to continue to drive revenue so that we are able to do so, to be able to bring um, that level of competition, that level of candidly joy to our fans. It's estimated to bring in $15 million. The legislation requires us to partner with a local casino or professional sports team. That partnership will ensure that local businesses in Missouri actually get a portion of the revenue generated from sports betting. This would allow betting inside the state's casinos, online and inside sports venues, as long as the team agrees. However, players are not fully on board. I wish I could say this morning that we have reached agreement on the few fundamental issues that uh, are, are paramount to the athletes, but we have not. And rumors of the Chiefs moving from Missouri to Kansas also have lawmakers leery. So if we helped you make this money, will we be guaranteed you won't leave us? But our first step is to figure out what's possible at Arrowhead. It's very special to the Hunt family. Um, it's very special to the, the community. Um, we know the community has done a lot to support it up till now. It's 50 years old, so we have to do our homework. Now, there is one hiccup so far in the Senate. It's the tax weight on wagers. Some senators don't think that 8% is enough for the tax. Now, if it is approved and it becomes law, Missourians are expected to bet more than $150 million a year. Reporting live tonight from Missouri State Capitol Bureau in Jefferson City, I'm Emily Manley, Fox 2 News.